I'm joined by Liz Hebner. She's the Dean of Students here at St. Ursula. And Liz, I notice as we're here, you've got a pink t-shirt. There's a lot of pink t-shirts here at St. Ursula. What's that all about? Well, this year, uh, the Ohio Athletic Association uh, is sponsoring Volley for the Cure, which is a, um, sponsored by Susan G. Coleman for breast cancer research. And they asked us to join and pick a game that, where we would have a competitor to, to have kind of a show between which side would wear more pink. And um, we sold shirts, and the proceeds from the shirts go towards breast cancer research. So you chose this week because it was against Notre Dame Academy? We chose, yeah, absolutely, because we're both all-girls schools, so we thought this would be a great opportunity. Is this the first year that the Ohio High School Association has deemed the schools do something for breast cancer awareness? I believe they might have been doing it in the past, but it's the first time we've heard of it here in um, Toledo. So we joined into it. Uh, this is the fifth year that we've done something for breast cancer, but the other years we've uh, just designed, we had our women's health class designed shirts and gave proceeds to breast cancer research. So with, with St. Ursula being so big in volleyball, it was a great opportunity for us. And it's not just these schools. It's all 800 schools that are participating at some point or another. Absolutely. There are schools across the United States that are joining in and uh, raising money for breast cancer research. Well, great work, Liz. Thanks for joining us. Thank you.